Hi there. I'm going to attempt to show you some major seven chords today. We'll start with a couple of easy ones and then we'll work on movable major sevens, ones we can move around and get any major seven we want. First let's start with an A major seven which is easy to make simply by going here. Take your third finger, put it on the B string at the second fret. You're going to also take your, your uh, second finger, that's third finger on the B string, second finger on the D string at the second fret, and then you bring in your first finger on the first fret on the G string. Now we're going to strum down from an A. We're going to start with an A and strum from there, and that Now if we put the E in, it doesn't sound too bad, but it sounds sweeter if we strum it from the A, because A is the root. That is an A major 7 chord. Okay, now let's switch to another easy one, which is going to be a D major 7 chord. We're going to simply take these three fingers, okay, we're not going to use the uh, first finger, we're going to use just finger 2, 3, and 4 and we're going to hold down all the strings at the second fret and play from the A string again and that's going to give us a D major chord D major 7 D major 7 now those were fairly easy now we need to learn how to play a more difficult one so that we can move this chord up the fretboard any place that we would like. Okay, So let's go to C major 7 here. Now I'll tell you what, let's do the easy C major 7 first. C major 7 is C, third finger here on the third fret, second finger on the second fret on the, on the D string and that gives us a C major 7 and we can strum that any way we want. That's just like a C chord, and you remove your finger, your first finger, and you get a C major 7. Now that's the easy C major 7. Now, a more difficult one is like this. See that? Same sound. Now this is a little bit more difficult one. Let's get in close where you can see this. Okay, we're going to bar, pretty much bar everything at the third fret and then use our other fingers to come in. We don't have to press down too hard once we get these fingers in place. Okay, so bar third fret, bring in your second finger on the, on the uh, G string at the fourth fret. Bring in your third finger on the fifth fret on the D string and bring in your pinky on the B string at the 5th fret. Okay? That's your C major 7. Okay, I hope you can see that. Okay? Now if I raise that a half step, you see I get C sharp major 7. D flat major 7. If I raise that another half step, I get D major 7. My root is here on my first finger. So that gives me D major 7. And that's your movable form. You can move that around. get any major 7 that you want. Okay. Alright, work on that. That's it for major 7s. Hope you enjoyed this and come back to see us soon here at eMusic Live.